Welcome to the video, today I'm going to show how you can update your Minecraft server to the latest version of Minecraft and this will work for any version. So as you can see I'm running on Minecraft 1.14 which is currently the latest version. Now if I go to multiplayer as you can see my server is currently running on 1.11 which is quite old. So in order to update this the first thing we need to do is go to our server uh, run command then we need to go ahead and type in stop and that's going to go ahead and save the server and stop it safely. So once we've safely stopped our server, we then need to go ahead and open up our web browser, click on the link below and it's going to take you to the Minecraft website. And here you're going to need to download the new Minecraft server options. So you're going to go ahead and click on this link here and it's going to go ahead and download it. Um, it may say that the file may harm your computer, but it's definitely not going to harm your computer since you're already using it and it's from the official Minecraft website anyways. Okay, so once we've downloaded our new version of the Minecraft server, you need to go ahead and open up your Minecraft server file. And what we're basically going to be doing is replacing the old Minecraft server uh, Java version with the new one. So we're going to just drag and drop the new one into our server folder. And once it's successfully moved into your Minecraft server file, we can then go ahead and delete the old Minecraft uh, Java version. And then we just need to go ahead and edit our run command to make sure that it's actually going to run this version of the Minecraft server and not the old one, which has been deleted. So to do that, all you want to do is go ahead and right click on your run command, go ahead and click on edit. Then what we need to do is go ahead and highlight all of this here, because this is going to be your old uh, Minecraft server name. And then we just need to go ahead and type the new one, which is just called server. So it should now just say server.jar. Then we can go ahead and click on file, save, and then when we go ahead and run this command here, it's going to load up the new version of Minecraft. Now, like I said before, it's very important that you back up your world, just in case something goes wrong, as you can't go back to previous versions of the Minecraft server. So as you can see, our server's now running, and again, like I mentioned, it may take a while, and it might do all this stuff, because it is converting it to the newer version of Minecraft. So we're going to go ahead and load up our Minecraft, refresh and then you should be able to access your server just like you could before but on the newer version of Minecraft. And again it may just take a little while at first because it is changing to the newer version. And as you can see I'm now in my new Minecraft server. So if this video is helpful please leave a like and pass on to someone who may find it helpful as well. If you do have any questions comment just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. So thank you so much for watching and have a good day.